The 19th Amendment, granting women the right to vote, was added to the U.S. Constitution by Secretary of State Bainbridge Colby's proclamation. After over 70 years of struggle, it passed in 1920. Despite this, women of color faced ongoing barriers like poll taxes. The movement began in the mid-19th century with activists from abolitionist and temperance circles. The first suffragist convention was in 1848. The 15th Amendment gave African-American men voting rights, but gender equality lagged. In 1869, Susan B. Anthony and Elizabeth Cady Stanton founded the National Woman Suffrage Association. The 19th Amendment passed the House in 1918 and the Senate in 1919. After campaigns, Tennessee ratified it in 1920. Secretary of State Colby signed it on August 26, making it law.